Uh, we're going to do a flat, we're going to show you how to shape a flat head on a muddler. Can you see how that's kind of narrow profile? Flat on the bottom and the top. We're going to use a razor blade. Um, and I'm going to try to just go straight along the top, just very gently slide that razor blade. Stop before I get to the wing. Go underneath. And the, it, it is tricky. Some, maybe I ought to be looking at what I'm doing. Because otherwise I'll think I have it flat top to bottom, but it's really kind of cut at an angle. And then I'm going to leave this fairly wide at the side. See how it's coming along right there? This is tied with a uh, uni yarn, kind of a hot orange. It's really nice body material, very thin, spins on very nicely. I want this a little bit, tiny bit narrower at the very front of the fly to work on those side angles. Sharp blade makes it go ever so much nice, more nicely. And again, one of the keys is just go real slow. You, you can just feel the blade grip there and pull a little bit of material off. Get a few straight hairs at the front. Now we got most of that done. I'm going to go in with my razor scissors and push that wing down and then clip those. Now, I could leave those spare pieces, and this would fish just fine. But I want it to look a little bit nicer. So I'm going to try to get those. And those are the butt sections. It's, it's Some people might be able to get all of those with their razor blade without getting the wing. I have trouble getting cutting into my wing, so... I don't. A little bit of hair smoothing there. Get a few strays. You get the point though. This is fairly low profile. This will skate very nicely. Uh, won't push quite as much water as that one that was the giant blocky thing. And lay lower in the water. There you have it. Razor blade shaped, low profile.